Greetings and welcome back to Dungeon Defenders. Today, Tubba Jubba and I are taking on the Alchemist Laboratory. This is the fourth map in the main storyline and the last map in the first section. Um, and there's supposed to be some sort of big nasty monster at the end in the final wave. So stick around and find out what happens. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back. What are we Oops. doing today? Again, we're I forgot. Bossing. We're bossing. What? We're bossing. <laughs> Is that Cajun? Yes. Okay. Uh, we've it's, got a... It's Sultan's redneck cousin. Cousin from the north. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just get on with this. Let's just do it. <sighs> Alright, I'm... out of the way, we can go serious all the way. Yeah, basically I'm letting you, uh do the setups then I'm just kind of putting in my towers in the background mm -hmm. so I'll get the, how do you want to do this from. one I mean I know how I do it it's just I pretty much just made sure everything's okay in the square that the crystals in yeah put everything in the center um one setup that I saw was really crazy it was nothing but uh, turrets or um, catapults or whatever that thing is the, the shooty thing that you use the harpoon? Yeah. It was five harpoons here and four harpoons here facing each other. Yeah, I've seen that one a lot, and frankly, I've tried that with uh, my Xbox version. Uh huh. It doesn't really work out that well because uh, if you work on higher levels, there's the Dark Elves, mm -hmm. the Assassin dudes, and they're not friendly with that. They, they go in and they smack it right away. Long before they can hit it. You mean long before the tur the towers can hit back? Yeah, that's what I mean. That's what I meant. You, you, you have to have a lot of range and a lot of attack rate for that to yeah. work. Yeah, I know. And that's why you have them facing each other, so that if one is getting attacked, the others can shoot back at it. So. It doesn't help if there's a ranger and he's like right here shooting at them. Mm -hmm. Right there. Because this... Uh, Tesla's in the way, but for some reason the archers can still shoot through it. Uh, grab the last two chests there. Okay. Uh, right now, that's pretty much my setup, except for putting uh, two bounces in the back here. You want me to set up uh, just a sh... Uh, I don't know if I have a strong enough shooter to put one right here. Oh, you're putting it around there. Okay. Um, just two back there, because I know there's usually the couple stragglers that go around. But mainly you want to focus on the front. Alright, I'll just focus forward. Uh, I have uh, an extra little bit here for you to take. Sure. That definitely helps. Um, see, I am I like to build things a lot closer to the crystal. Yeah. Honestly, if I were to ever make a tutorial series of this game, I would literally just spend like five minutes talking while shifted to look at the map, and in the editing I would just highlight everything I'm talking about. It would be hell for me because I am impatient as hell. Let me try something. Let's try that. I haven't done that before. So. That, that'll that be able to hit it, but I'm pretty sure my bounce block will be able to hit it first. Like I said, I'm gonna try. Yeah. GG! Let's do and we're this. Bo we're both fairly close to the same level as well. Like, I'm, I'm about to hit 15. Same here. Like I'm either this round or next round will be 15. Yeah, same. Like I'm a little bit more than halfway through, almost two thirds. Oh, I'm more like five eighths. Or no, not five eighths. More like seven eighths. I'm much closer to. Why was seven? Why was six afraid of seven? Cause seven, eight, nine. I know. So corny. Well, that's all I am. After all, you are what you eat. And frankly, that is all I eat nowadays. Wow. I'm sorry, but I like corn in my burritos. Huh? Wait, you never had corn burrito? Oh yeah. Get her to Taco Bell all the time. 
Oh, it's so good, eh? Black beans and rice. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm not really much of a bean guy. I usually ask to have it without the beans. I don't know why. I just I'm just not a bean guy. Oh. Hey. Exactly. I'm, I'm, I'm not trying to say that I'm too good for being. Just saying I'm, I'm, I'm too sophisticated to toot. You got any more mana? Awesome. <laughs> I have any more mana? Two hundred. Hmm. And there's also more mana over here. Oh, I didn't see that other chest. Okay. I'll bring it to you there. No, I, I didn't need it. I just needed, like, one point of mana. That's all I needed. Well, it doesn't matter. So, here, set up some turrets. Or whatever you want to set up. Oh, well, I do have something that's pretty good, and I'm pretty sure you're going to like them. Why are you doing that? I have to set them up. You got a whole minute. Oh. Bouncy balls. <laughs> oh shoot, that is not in a good position right now. It has to be more like... That. There, that is a good position right there. And over here as well. I've never really done the bouncy balls on this level. I, uh, I, f I find this is one of the best maps to do it on. I like uh, the second one with the bouncy balls, because it goes... They actually... If you set them up right, you can get it to go around the corners. Yeah. All for you. I don't want it. GG. Awesome. Ooh. I think I'm going to say GG every time we start a map with Gs. Sure. Just just, just because. Just because. Go well. You guys haven't seen my new Blasty yet, have you? <laughs> and this is this is for all you guys who like bowling. <laughs> <laughs> wow. From from here, there was this, there's a staff. And it kind of looked like the bowling ball broke on the staff. But technically, that is not just impossible because the bowling ball is made out of a, a polyurethane that is actually very durable. Sorry, what? I got my blasties. Ooh, I got a helmet. It is so much better than what I've got. <laughs> oh, uh, I got lag again. Woo! Ah, <sighs> lag. Probably just because of how much man is on the ground at a time. Oh, yeah. Either that or there's something to do with numbers. <laughs> it's always to do with numbers. Exactly. Uh, okay, well, those two are done. Um, now, there's something that I should probably mention. I usually don't keep these bouncing blockades here all the time. Because normally, normally what I do is I do this. Yeah. Go for it. Because, frankly, I find that it's so good because it can get everybody at, in that area. Yeah. Boop and boop. Get everybody down there that's coming up that way and everybody that's going up the other way. Well, let me, uh... Want some mana? I got some mana. Wait. You got mana bomb? No, not really. Saw that. There we go. That's my right-click attack. I don't have a... Uh, oh, yeah, that's right, the mana explosion. I don't have a block. You don't have, yeah, you don't have the mana bomb uh, until level 20. Yeah. So it's... Until 400 MP. Mm -hmm. I, I am such an RPG guy. Okay. So... I think what I will do is, I don't know if this is going to work, but I won't know until I try. Oh yeah, that'll definitely work. <laughs> I do that all the time whenever I play with the Adept on the Xbox, or whenever I used to. <laughs> oh. Yeah, if, if it had more range, it would definitely work, but I'm just barely covering the hallway down below. GG! In fact, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to level it up. Oh. Yeah, that's why I gave you that extra little bit of uh, uh, 
Nice. Oh, and it hits them all. I forgot what that thing did. Well, it is a lightning one, so obviously it's gonna change. Oh, I just got hit. Somebody hit me. I just got hit by a uh, freaking lag. Oh no, me, it was a. I think it was an explodey dude. Well, I got lag, so. Uh, kamikaze, I guess. Is I, what you I apologize it. for my viewers, my tens of viewers. Those of you who are actually interested in seeing it, a fully aggressive play. Because I'm, oh, I'm just playing. Involved. I'm definitely playing aggressive now. Yeah. I mean, I've got my shooty, so. Uh, too bad it doesn't do enough damage. Yeah, well, I'm up front attacking them and they're attacking me. Mm. I'm not just standing up on the ledge. Oh, me neither. I'm right in their face. So you can yeah, but I get tear the more, them apart. I get the most aggro, so. Yeah. Duh. No, it's once I was able to get a uh, multi shot, then I was definitely going to start getting into things. Yeah. Because that's, that's what I love about this character. She's fast, and she has the multi shot. I think I should slow down on the aggro for a little bit there because I think that's what's causing me the lag. Because all the numbers showing up on screen. Uh, I don't know why, it's just weird. I don't know. Are you still getting the lag? Yeah, a little bit. I'm not getting any at all. I'm not getting as much as I did last map, but still it's a bit troublesome. Yeah, usually uh, later on with like the wave waves, um, say around 10 or 20, um, I just, once the defenses are set up, all I do is run around in circles on this map. Yeah. Got another, uh, well, I guess I could just collect some mana. Never mind. I just need another 50 and I can upgrade the other bowling ball turret I put down to uh, the second level. One more, and there we go. Uh, hopefully it's just like... My tower damage is now 21. I hope it, I'm just getting like visual lag and it's not actually affecting my recording. Oh, it will. Sorry, uh, but it will. I I don't think so because it doesn't always happen for me. That it also affects my. Um, well, for me, what I see on the screen is what actually ends up being in the recording. So. Well, that's because you're using fraps. I'm using Bandicam. Oh. Like Bandicam is a little bit less accurate. <laughs> it slows down the computer, but not the recording. It it focuses mostly Weird. on the, the recording. Uh, let's see. What did I get? Unlock. All right. Is there something so. else that need? really should be upgraded. Uh, probably one of these electric things. For some reason, it's telling me the engineer is better for me. Okay. The only reason why it's better for me is because it gives me plus 18 tower health, but I can't use it until I'm level 25. <laughs> I know. Like, come on. <laughs> Obviously, it's going to be better for me. But by then, I'm going to have something so much better than that. Hopefully. Um... Yesterday I was actually farming this boss. Yeah. GG! Oh. I'll level up at, at the end of this there. And next round is the boss, guys. And this is obviously going to be the longest one that we're going to be doing in this uh, session. Yeah. Ooh, my bowling ball turret's actually doing some decent work right here. Yeah. Your bowling balls need to have a much higher firing rate for sure. Yeah. I'm used I've to the really constant steady that. bowling balls. <laughs> well, I'm sorry if I'm going over. No, that's fine. Being sarcastic. Alright. Uh, uh, Looking for enemies to shoot. Turns. They're all up here. Oh, okay. Oh, what do you got? Uh, plus five shot or plus three shot? Plus three shot. It gives me four. Nice. Why am I not affecting that ogre at all? Or that orc? Keep it's probably because... It's He's probably because... Uh, do you have an element damage on it? Uh, um, yeah, I think so. 
Okay, I might have been resistant to it. Let me look. I have so much like yeah, it's space. it's one point of lightning. <laughs> yeah, I've already leveled up. Like the bonus XP from just beating the wave didn't even like I leveled up before that, so okay. it's quite possible that I level up twice in this. Especially yeah, with, with the, the boss. Well, not this wave isn't the boss wave. Yeah. Especially with the boss, I'm pretty sure I'll level up twice. So that means you'll level up like 18 times. Uh. My mama always told me life was like a box of chocolate. Somebody's always gonna get a better one. <laughs> so wrong. What? I like Force Gun. Okay. I gotta get me one of these. All right, I got plus seven in uh, attack range. I got my, so, I got my final tower. I've so got to place one. The one thing is, I've noticed this as well, with uh, Squire and the bouncing blockades and the regular blockades. If you increase their area of effect and mm -hmm. the in the size of this as well, they actually get so much bigger. Like if you max out uh, the AOD, <laughs> check it out. <laughs> wow. Nice. I know. I've still, I've still got, uh, actually, no, I, I'm actually at that level. I just need uh, 10 more. You know, you know why they're aimed backwards, though, don't you? You shouldn't have to ask. Yeah, I, I, I know. I kind of want And we're going to upgrade them. And I'm going to show you guys the awesomest thing in the universe. <laughs> the one, the only, the slice of dice. Uh, yeah. Put it right down where the boss lands. Exactly. Don't That's put it. I... Don't put it exactly where he lands, cause it'll kill it. I've yeah. had that happen. I know. That's In why, fact, uh... I've had a player die because of it. That's why. Uh, when... <laughs> That's why when we, like, in between the wave and the boss. Uh, I will upgrade it as much as I possibly can. Yeah. So, yeah. GG! He'll, he'll land on it and he'll... This one, I don't think he'll kill this, but if it was any further back, it would kill. he would kill it. Uh, I've placed it here a bunch of times, he doesn't... Nice. Like, he, even on medium, he wouldn't kill this, because I have a lot of health on it. Like, if you place it right in front of the forge, he'll land on it and kill it. Yeah, so, I know. Sucks. Oh, I forgot this uh, chest here. Are there any more chests that we forgot? No? Okay. Great. It's not oh. enough to really do a whole lot of good at this point. Okay, maybe I should uh, not be aggro anymore. Maybe that would be a good idea. Just stand back. That's what I wanted too. I think it's your shots that's actually giving you a little bit of lag too. I think everything's giving you a little lag. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I love what these balls are doing. <laughs> um, you might want to rephrase that. Bowling balls. There you go. Oh, it knocks them back too. That's great. Whoa, 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 watch out for yeah, that. Yeah, that's, that's one thing that actually pulls me towards the boring balls, is because of the, the awesome knockback. But other than that, they're, they're not really that useful. Oh, I was talking about the mana burst. Oh, the mana burst? Yeah, yeah that knocks them back. Oh. Well, the, uh, the bowling balls actually do give a little bit of knockback, too. Oh, definitely. If you give them a lot of damage, too, they knock back so far. Alright, I am at max mana, and I'm going to be upgrading that slice of things. Upgrade? Well, yeah, I'll upgrade it behind you. Yeah, I'll upgrade it the first two levels there, and you well, upgrade I the can't last one. do the last one. Don't you have 300? I thought it was four. Oh, is it four? It's oh, four. Yeah, I can't it, upgrade it. Okay, well, 
Whatever, we'll Boss go with you. approaching. Uh, let me get on one of my towers. There we go. Wait, are these backwards? I thought these were forward. No, they're. I thought, I, I thought they're they, facing I thought... towards the crystal, which is backwards. Okay, that, that's what that's what I thought. Like, <laughs> that to me, that's not backwards because that's forwards to me with the boss. No, that's backwards because the enemies come from the other direction. But the boss is the most important threat. Yeah, of course. That's why I say these are pointing forward towards the true enemy. And the crystal! Me. Destroy awesome. the crystal! Awesome cutscene. <laughs> Badass boss. What the heck? <laughs> I, I was behind a Tesla core. Yeah. I was actually stuck on your <laughs> slice and dice. <laughs> My slice and dice is in the way. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Best. Whoa! Holy crap. Okay, I got a Tesla. I don't even bother with Teslas normally, but uh, yeah, well, he took away he took away more than half my health. So, well, that is because you got the. Uh, there we go. Boss yeah. defeated. I didn't realize he no was going to. No need to worry. I didn't realize he was going to do that thing. I think I got like three levels off of that. Oh, so much blue mana. Yep. Yeah. I went to 16. Same here. Ooh. Uh, so one speed, one that, and the rest of it. Awesome. Alright. Let's get some more mana here. So we're both at pretty much the same level. It's awesome. I think I'm just gonna go around and collect these. Uh, and I will show off the new Demon Blade that I just got off this guy. Off this dead guy who is now going to stay here forever. It should be a level 14 item, though. Uh, no, I think it's level 14 on easy. Uh, yeah, Demon Training Blade. It's actually a lot better than what I got. Uh, Demonic Heirloom is what I got. Gives me minus two player health, but I have a lot of player health, so that doesn't really matter. And none of none of the versions that I've got in my store from farming this guy yesterday are better than the one I've already got. And there wow. goes a fire truck. Let's see. This armor that I've got is also so much better than what I've got. Awesome. Sweet. Now I was farming this guy for about three hours and then never play this game again. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds uh, like a plan, buddy. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to cut to the tavern where we will just check out the last minute items in the shop and then we'll end off the episode. See you guys in just a second. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, okay. It's just attack rate, so... Right. Let's give that to Hero. Um, what armor did you get from him, too? It should have been... Um... Uh, I'm just closing the stats here. We'll look at it in, we'll look at it in the uh, tavern. Well, I'm already here, so... Okay. Let's see. I thought uh, you'd already... Stocky, unlucky, plate best. You got the cursed one. No. It's, if, if it says cursed... Oh. Unlucky. Unlucky, that means uh, it has minus stats. So it has minus t 11 to poison resistance and minus 4 to uh, fire resistance. But I got luck a polish. Luck lu no, wait. Luck luckily enough, it gave me uh, 11 resistance to lightning. I keep thinking double click actually equips it, but it doesn't. No, it doesn't. Okay, so where did it go? Let's see, I am most valuable player. I suppose this should actually show you guys this. I am MVP once again. Uh, let's see, 497 kills. Uh, immortal banker, trigger happy. <laughs> yes, I was very trigger happy then. Uh, flawless victory. Wow. Yeah. I've got a.
ton of awards. Immortal, Invincible, Strategist, Handyman, Janitor, Chillax, Flawless, First Kill, Boss Slayer, Master Builder, Knight, and Master Strategist. Oh, but I didn't get them. MVP. <laughs> How many kills did you get? Uh, uh, you were literally 25 under me. Nice. Alright, so just looking in the waves here, um, enemies were fairly tough in the beginning, but I guess once we got a handle of everything and started upgrading, we just went up. Oh, nice. Uh, it didn't feel, feel that hard at all. No. Uh, let's see, defense is built 7, sp uh, spawned and killed 28-28. Night metal. Interesting. Uh, Team score, we got. Wow. Well, we were terrible with team score and stuff. How does that right. work? Uh, it just takes everything, rounds it down. Because okay. technically, te technically our team score is 41k, but uh, overall with the leaderboards, it rounds it down to 1130. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Alright, so now we'll see you in the tavern. Tavern time! I just paused my recording just so that has a nice little quick jump cut. The Huntress, Squire, Apprentice, and Monk arrive at the castle's interior, exhausted after their epic battle with the terrifying monstrosity. The Apprentice wonders where these dastardly creatures are coming from. The Huntress remarks that evil beings must be drawn towards the energies contained within the Eternia Crystals. The monk, who has taken a vow of silence, stoically stares off into the distance, as if remembering something from a dream. The squire boasts that it doesn't matter where their opponents hail from, as long as they fall beneath his sword. On that, the team agrees and forges on into the castle to turn back the tide. Dun, 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 dun. I'm an idiot and completely forgot that, so sorry for the missing of like three seconds of that. And now we return to the tavern where I'm not going to jump cut because we're already here. <laughs> well, what you could do is, uh, if we re redo this map, no, I, you can I, get I just, a cut I just, of it. I just missed like, uh, the, uh, the uh, apprentice and squire. That's all I missed out of that. Okay. <laughs> so I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure they won't care. I'm well, I think I'm going to... I'm gonna think I'm gonna call this episode here, and we'll see you guys on the, the next the next time around. Um, yeah, sure. Um, but I just want to show you guys the DPS of this sword that I got because it is awesome. Oh, okay. I hit 500, part... 510. Can I get? I hit 283. 512. Like, but then again, you have four, four <laughs> shots, one that's just so... I know. <laughs> Alright, see you guys in the next episode. Alright. No, wait, um... Hit your... Hit your... Hit the doll. I wanna see it. I wanna see it. I wanna see it. Alright. It's a slow weapon, though. Oh, yeah. Like, if... I, uh, wait, no, I sold that one. Um, if I had my other weapon, it would probably, like, 500 DPS. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. Out of push, I guess. French. Alright. That's End it. Off. We'll see you later. End off an episode of French. Woo.